450y equals n cubed. Okay, so what is the point of that equals in, equaling an integer cubed? Well, that means when you take the cube root of something, you raise it to the one third. For instance, the cube root of two to the nine is two to the nine to the one third, which is two to the third. So you divide the exponent by three. Now that means that each exponent in the perfect or in the in the exponent of a prime of each prime of a perfect cube. Sorry, the exponent in each prime of a perfect cube must be divisible by three. So we have to see how four fifty is sitting. Um, that's 45 and 10, 2 and 5, 9 and 5, 3 and 3, so that's 2, 3 squared, 5 squared. So that times y equals a perfect cube. So what does y need to be? Well, y is just completing the cube. Say we have one tube, but we need two more twos to get to three, three tubes. So y needs to be 2 squared. We have 3 squared, we need one more 3. We have 5 squared, we need one more 5. Now, if, if y is that, then all of that multiplied together will end up being 2 to the third, 3 to the third, 5 to the third. So y completes the cube. So now we know what y is. We actually don't care about any of this stuff anymore. Now we're just asking a question about y. These are all these different trip-ups to know what a variable is divisible by. And then you set it equal to that. So the first one is y, 2 squared, 3, and 5. Is that divisible by 3, 2 squared, 5? Yeah, we got everything. Everything cancels. That, that works. Number two does not work. Why not? 3 squared, 2, and 5. Remember the fundamental rule is you can have extras on the numerator, but not in the denominator. We've got 3 squared down here, but only 3 up here. That one won't cancel. So everything else will. We'll have a 2 left over there, but this 3 will cancel. And then we'll have to be left with a 3 on the denominator. So 2 over 3, that won't work. we got too many 3s. And ideally, you just get used to looking at it. Okay, we got 3 squared there. No good. What about this one? 2 squared, 3, and 5. We got any extras in the denominator? Yep. 5 squared, that's no good. So that one... That one won't work either. It's just one only.